Hello, I'm Howard Falco, and welcome back to the video blog series, Two Minutes of Truth. This is the fifth and last blog in this particular series about creating the life you desire. This one is dedicated to offering you the essence of the source of all of your creative power in life. As with all of the information in the blogs that have been presented to you, it will ultimately be up to you and your willingness to challenge your previous beliefs on the nature of life and contemplate this new information coming to you now. Your will to open to, accept, and integrate this material, if you so choose, will determine how fast things change in your life. And as always, you have 100% control over this. In the last blog, we talked about how fear prevents you from creating anything new. It does this by projecting undesired outcomes that keep you from taking action. The danger is when these false ideas remain unchallenged in your mind. These false ideas then become destined as beliefs to be lived out as truths in your life, thus leading you to much of your limitations and suffering. For real change, the root of the false nature of the fear-based belief must be faced and challenged. Otherwise, it's like pulling a weed. If you don't get to the root, in a few days, the weed will surface right back to bother you again. Examples of this are any continual undesired patterns in life, like addictions, bad relationships, repetitive financial struggles, recurring anxiety, and so on. Your fears end up being self-fulfilling. However, thankfully, faith is also self-fulfilling. Ultimately, at some point, faith becomes the only thing that can overcome fear. Now this is not a religious faith or a spiritual faith or a faith related to some untrue notion that you can never understand life, but rather a simple faith in the understanding of the creative power inside you. Faith comes from the realization that you, in order to be here to listen to these words now, have gotten through every other trying and challenging time in your life. Even the ones that at the time you had no idea how you were going to get through. Yet here you are. It is not a matter of if you will survive any attempt to change things or to create the life of your dreams, but rather only a matter of if you will intend to make them a reality by trying. And when challenged along the path to your dreams, will you see the purpose and the perfection for each challenge, learn from them, and continue with the will to move forward in the pursuit of what you ultimately desire? You cannot fail. You have overcome it all, and you will overcome it all. When you realize this, you will know the essence of true faith, and you will know a world without limits. The question to ask yourself when you are done watching this is, who am I? Remember, you cannot create the experience of anything you have not chosen to fully believe in and become. The key is in declaring a new you believing in a new you, and demonstrating the belief by acting as a new you. A new you that perfectly harmonizes with what you desire. You have the pen. The story is yours to write. What will you write for yourself today? What energy representing you will you demonstrate to your world right now? I want to truly thank you for taking the time to view this. In the near future, my book will be available that explains all of this and much more about the nature of life and the creation of you within it. In the meantime, please feel free to visit my website, truthserum.net, for more on the forthcoming book and everything I've talked about in these blogs. There is no one who is more powerful than you. In this moment, you have a golden opportunity to realize your unlimited capacity to create and to align this creative ability with your true heart's desire. In this moment, you have the opportunity to see the truth of your perfection and honor that perfection by freely releasing more of the powerful, endless source of love that is inside you to everyone in your daily walk of life. This is the essence of how your world truly changes. I'm gonna leave you now with a powerful thought that if embraced, can change everything for you. So until next time, right now, in this moment, simply love who 
you are. So long.